Hi YouTube, this is Ruben and thank you so much for clicking on my video and start to talk with me, you know. I just want to do this video or I want to make this video without uh, taking in my mother tongue. I just want to want you to hear my voice like native without interacting, without I don't know, just so most of the time my voice or when I see to other part of the camera is because I am to trying to sink in my mind. If you see that I'm not uh, looking for or watching another part that that is not the camera, because I am constantly trying to talk with you. And I think this is the way I can talk, this is the way I can concentrate myself and try to speak and I don't know why I'm trying to concentrate myself trying to speak because I want to speak like native version, I want to get the fluency in the language which is for this reason I'm here. And if you see that if I do this or if I do this, it's because I'm thinking in my mind. Let's start with the video. So now, I decided to do this video because I want to, I would like to tell you that, as you know, I am learning English because I want to get fluent this year. This last year I was focused on improve my vocabulary, improve the way I had to talk to can generate ideas in my mind. And as you see now I can talk to people. I have um, certain skills that I can take advantage of it because I want to dedicate this year to be focused on my fluency. Because the fluency uh, from my point of view is for example you can handle some topics better than other topics and basically this is uh, what is about the fluency I mean if you can speak uh, better than other topics you are more fluent in certain topics but the thing is that for example I want to achieve that moment that I am not taking in my mind I mean try to struggle with looking for words because I heard that it happened because you this vocabulary is not in your mind in your mouth is not in your knowledge because for this reason uh, when you are thinking about any topic and you are in this gap is because you you don't have this knowledge so the recommendation I heard uh, was that the idea is just try to talk try you to focus your message just on the word you know I mean if you have certain uh, skills with uh, vocabulary just use that all those all those knowledge you have in vocabulary just use the word you know this is what you hear all right the other technique that i know is just learn the words you need to conversation i mean don't waste your time maybe uh, learning all the amount of animals there is in the world for example because i am using a uh, man rice and i am using you I, and, and i am using other app which is called linguist i think it's called like this but the, the thing is that if you just learn words if you just learn for example uh, how do you say place how do you say when it those words just trying to put in a sentences because the sentences bring bring to us give us contents right and this is what I hear in that audio and I, and I wanted to recommend to you who are learning languages or maybe if you are just started learning English and, and you are guided you by the subtitles Spanish title this is the the two sims I heard which is is great to learn languages, to practice languages. The other thing is that, for example, we are used to don't use use the language because if you speak Spanish or if you live in South America, there is not people who speak English. And because of that, you can practice in real 
face to face, but you can practice using the internet, some tools which is important for you. And the way is that if we if we can get fluent, we have to talk with people, with your friend, with your co-workers in your company. You need to look for, I mean, trying to every time speak the language. If you read some uh, article of, if you read blogs, just read it, read it in English and read out loud because this is the way we can connect the motion, the motion of of our mouth, the motion of our tongues. Uh, we can uh, have that connection with our, our mind, you know. And when you speak, in this case, I'm talking. Is because I I have used this word before, you know, and this is the way I heard in this. Uh, it's important for us to practice the language. And the last one is immerse yourself in the language. Right now, I'm not recording with headphones because I have damaged a lot of headphones. If you have any headphone for me really, I mean, a great headphone, please tell me what is that headphone, headphone because I have been using headphones this year around eight or nine, seven headphones and all those headphones has been damaged because I don't know, they are so bad, I don't know. If you hear some of my video, I, I, I used to put a different video in the practically um, practically and in, in every each video I use another kind of he headphones because of that so the thing is that just immerse yourself in the language try to 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 have a lot of content try to to use the shadowing if you don't know shadowing I'm gonna recommend you here below one video about shadowing which is basically repetition you learn by rep by repetition and the the last one that I consider which is important and so important is don't be afraid to speak English don't be afraid I don't know if you feel afraid to express yourself yourself and maybe the biggest wall is our pronunciation I will want to tell you just practice your pronunciation Practice the way you pronounce, the way you said words. Just practice those things, and you will feel more confidence when you pronounce words when you talk. And don't be shy. If you're in in those places who, if you speak English, the people are, ah, you know, kind of uh, laughing of yourself the way you speak. Don't don't matter, because if you feel shy, this is a very um, don't allow you that that attitude don't allow you to improve your English your vocabulary don't feel shy don't feel I mean embarrassed talking English okay and I'm doing this kind of video because first of all I want to tell you that and secondly I wanted to practice my, my English and record my record myself speaking the language in order to keep improving every day okay so thank you so much for watching the video i'll see you until my next youtube video bye bye